Oh, silver. Got 90%. Okay. The accuracy was ass, though. First aid kit. <laughs> Alright, so we're playing as Michael now. What should we do? Huh. Let's see. We got some Solomon missions. We'll do that. I don't have a car. Okay, so we'll do the Solomon one first, and let's call a taxi. Yeah, hey, I need a cab. No problem. I'll have one there in a couple of minutes. Appreciate it. Where are you, taxi? I'm not sure if they drive from the bottom or top. Just have to wait for one. Okay. Hello there, taxi. So, where do you want to go? I'm going to have to drop you. Johnny? Hey, you're a couple real badasses. Put a beat down on an old man. Yeah, we don't take that. We have a you deal okay? with them. Just above. Please, get those millennial ass wipes. With pleasure. You fuck what? Hey, here's an old man who might hit back. Sharp corner. Head. I guess I didn't make it clear to you at the club! One down, got one. How you like me now? Wonder who I shot though. I think it was the other guy, obviously. There was two of them. We made some progress. Car does not handle well. Oh, big those sharp turns. This car needs to get out of the way. What is this shit? They always have one. Oh my god, one car that's ready to hit you. Dear, I know this is frustrating to watch. It is for me too. Just stay on this highway and then. It's like two ahead. He's gonna make a weird turn, isn't he? Him. Oh, 
I beat you, so you beat it on I can't use my uh, special ability as him. I should have whacked you when I had the chance. He's dead. I thought you were a tough guy. Leave the area. Just gotta make sure he's dead. There we go. Now we gotta go back. Turns out maybe I'm cut out for the movie business after all, huh? My friend, you're a sentimental thug with zero artistic training and nothing interesting to say. I would say you're overqualified. <laughs> anyway, shut up and take a look at that. Oh. Oh. Fucking A. Feels good, doesn't it? Feels like I've finally done something with my life. Actually done something. A movie. Welcome to show business. Nothing but make-believe will ever feel quite real again. <laughs> All right, Michael, come on. Let me show you some rushes. I think you're gonna love it, but it'd be great to hear your notes. Hey, baby. I just wanted to tell you, I'm finally doing something with my life. I'm making a movie. A real one. Call me. Sweet. Ah. Oh, that was terrible. Start up, you piece of shit. Okay, let's get that out of there. I think your sign's a little gone. So where are we headed to now? Let's go to... Lester's place. Hopefully nothing weird will happen. Wrong way. Wrong side of the road. Well then. Okay then. I'll do the side missions uh, once I go back and free roam so you guys can enjoy those too. Get out of here. They were so close to me as I hit like three cars. That's no bad. Gonna make that U-turn. And we are at Lester's place. a little labor dispute. See, we're about to do something really, really bad. So I need to present myself as a proper textile magnet, so... So you stop making anything? Nothing looks more suspicious in America than someone who's actually prepared to make something. 
Jesus. What about you? Oh, pocket, Trevor. We're having some problems. Brad. Yeah, what else? Yes, anyway, the Union Depository is on hold for now. Can't do it without him, especially now that he knows. Yeah, thank but... God you guys are here. You alone? Davey, where's your boyfriend, Steve? He's on his way up. Yeah, they're up here. Listen, this shit's about to hit the fan. Our entire lives together has been nothing but a series of fans and shits. Sort this problem out for me, and I will get Mr. Leisure Wear off your back. And if we don't? Then I will go to jail and you will get shot. Ah, fuck you, Dave. I've heard it all before. Not like this, you haven't. Has he briefed you? Oh, well, yes, he has. He told us that if we do what you say, then together we can take down the big bad wolf that is government <laughs> corruption. Yeah, and if you don't, we're all gonna fry. Because the agency's onto us. I've even got some fools in our own bureau that are questioning my methods. <laughs> Think I'm a liar, <laughs> a cheater, some kind of a killer and a thief. So? So, there's some, uh, evidence. And I need you guys to find out what they know. All right, so what? You want Lester here to hack into the system, wipe it all clean? Oh, no, no, that will not work. The only way to access it is through your buildings. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Michael. You'd be doing me a very big favor. And if you do this, I will make sure that all your files are deleted. I promise you. Hey! It's the last thing we do, and we're done. Period. Of course. I'm a man of my word. Dave, let's go. Come on, Lester, let's go. Good luck, gentlemen. Interesting, all right. That guy's still there. He's still there. Okay. Maybe we gotta push his body out. There we go. We got $16. Get in, Lester. We're gonna have to run you over. Get in. Oh my god. Get in the car. Okay, hold on. I know how to fix it. <laughs> Lester would not get in the car. There we go, now Lester's in the car. Take us to the bureau, parking garage entrance. So, you got any idea how we'll do this? Scope it out? Uh, not really, but I thought we'd start by finding a way into the building. We're going in through the parking lot? No, 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 no. we're waiting for someone to come out of it. A janitor. All right. And how's that gonna get us in? Well, the janitors are all on temp contracts. They get replaced when they're back.